All right, what I want to show you how to do is how to access the research papers that you submitted to me on JunoDocs, uh, see the suggestions and comments and corrections that I made, and then make those revisions in JunoDocs. There's one small problem, which uh, could be a big problem, but we'll see if we can cross that bridge when we come to it. So, I have opened up my uh, Jupiter Grades page for this imaginary student, Phil Anderson. And what you're going to do is exactly what Phil Anderson is going to do now. On the left-hand side, just above Tests and Lessons, is something called the File Locker. Click on the File Locker, and then you'll see all the assignments that have been turned in. And we have ones at the top that are not turned in. We don't want to ignore those. We're going to go to the ones that say Turned In Recently. And that includes the research paper. And the bottom is the title of it, Draft 1, Reviewed by Paul Jolly. So click on that. Up pops this little dialog box, and what you want to select is the Open button, and here it is. As you will see, the comments can be two colors, pink for uh, suggestions of things that I think you should correct, and green only occasionally when something was particularly well phrased or well said. However, as I look at this, I can't make any changes right on here. What I need to do is click on the Revise button at the top. When I do, I get a split screen which appears. At the bottom is the version that was reviewed by the teacher. At the top is the one that you can make corrections on. As you scroll through, you'll notice if you hover over one of the corrections, like I'll hover over US History, the box over on the right-hand side, Use Class Name and Subject, that becomes highlighted. This will be useful when there's more than one comment on a sentence. So now I see I want to use the Class Name and Subject, so I can go back up here. Instead of US History, I'm just going to add that this is Axis US History, and the class is Ringo. Very good, that correction is made. The next thing I have down here, it says between a rock and a hard place, and it's informal. Okay, so I want to make this a little bit more formal rather than such a uh, casual blasé phrase. So maybe I'll say uh, the most trying of times, the battle for Okinawa. Hopefully, the teacher will be happy with that. Then I scroll down farther, and you'll see here, now we've got a sentence that has two different comments on it. If you hover over the comment, then you'll notice that the part that it applies to becomes highlighted. The opposite works as well. You could hover over the part that is highlighted, and then the comment becomes highlighted. So I'll go ahead and make these changes in here, as it says, introduce the topic first before you go into detail about it. The changes have to take place up here. Uh, in the top half of the split screen. And when they're all done, I'm going to go to the top right corner and click Save and Close. Now here is the problem. I really wanted you to be able to share the version that I edited with the other person that you worked with. Unfortunately, on Juno Docs, the only thing that you can share, let me just open this again, is the actual copy that you're going to work on to revise. So what you'll need to do is either sit down with your partner at a computer where you can both look at this section together and see all the comments that were made and then make your corrections up top. Or you may want to print out this bottom section and I suggest you use a color printer. It'll be easier to see the information. And then at the top here you can actually share this version to make revisions. If you click on the little triangle button and go share for review. Click on that, type in your partner's name. In this case, let's see, I'll make up a name. Oh, there's a new guy in our core named Carl Larm. Boy, he's just going off. I click Find, and there he is. And I'll click Invite. Now, when Carl logs into Jupyter Grades, he's going to look in his file locker, and he's going to see the assignment with my name on it. Both of you can then make suggestions and corrections on the document. Try it out and let me know as soon as possible if there's any complications or difficulties. Revisions are expected to be completed by Tuesday. Several of you, I'm asking you to make some pretty significant revisions in terms of the research that you're doing and changing the overall focus of your paper. So don't put this off until the last minute if you want to do a good job. If you've got any questions, let me know.